How would you describe how this fall golf season has gone for Lemmy, boys and girls? You know, it's been pretty good. Um, Cameron Jackson played pretty solid this year. Cameron like finished outside the top ten once, won twice. Um, Jackson got his first win. I think it's a. It's been a. We're still pretty young, but it's been a good year for us. Um, at the end of the day, we've, we've got a long ways to go, but um, hopefully we're learning and playing a little smarter and getting it done. So. As you approach state uh, in Gillette, what do you talk to these kids about? You know, it's always about course management. You know, <laughs> these young kids want to, they see the Dustin Johnsons, the Brooks Kepkes, the these guys just ripping it off of every tee. And they just, <laughs> these guys have A, the strength and the ability to, to do that on tour, but these guys are young kids just don't they have to be a little smarter and so um not making those big numbers you know it's <laughs> there's always a joke between agater and i that you know we will have 15 really good holes and then three blow up holes and it's that's typical laramie high school golf and so we're trying to minimize that um just about mi by making better better decisions on the golf course and and uh and being more consistent in our thought processes and so as you look at Bell Knob, a lot of these kids haven't played there because you guys don't travel as extensively as you used to yeah. uh, due to various reasons. So how important does the practice round become Thursday, and, and how do you feel like you've got to set things up for these kids to play well this weekend? Sure, sure. You know, it's <laughs> it's one of those things where I've played competitive golf for a long time, and I think our ability to change the way that we that we do things in a practice round, you know, really prepare ourselves, put together a game plan and, and a map to – that we can execute during during the actual tournament rounds, I think is big. Um, something that I do, it's something that a lot of the <laughs> a lot of the pros out there do, and so um, and I, th I don't think it's something that a lot of high school golfers ever do, right? We want to be really intentional about every shot that we that we take. But at the end of the day, Bill Knobs, a it's a pretty it's a long golf course, but it's pretty wide open. You know, it's pretty forgiving, um, and so just making good decisions. At the, at the end of the day, that's what it always comes down to. So. How do you feel like you guys fit in 4A right now after seeing a lot of the teams, particularly at Casper last weekend? Yeah, yeah. Um, we're <laughs> we've got potential to be the, the second best. Our boys do at least be the second best team in the state. I mean, Kelly Walsh is so far ahead of everybody right now. Um, but we took second by 25 shots or whatever at, at conference last year, and so we've got we've got some good potential to be uh, to be consistent again if we play smart and, and do our job. Um, we, especially at a golf course like Bell, Bell Knob, where you can't, I mean, the, you, you can hit it anywhere and be good, you know. And so I think as long as they play within themselves and, and do their do their due diligence, um, it becomes pretty easy for us to, to finish in the top three or something like that at state.